Hello, Jeremy. This is Bauer at Alderman Chevrolet, Buick, and GMC, Vermont's favorite car dealership, where we're known for two things, awesome deals and fabulous service. Today, I wanted to send you a video of this 2017 Ford Explorer with a 3.5 liter V6 engine. It was a beautiful SUV with just over 69,000 miles on it. it. Has 290 horsepower and about 255 foot-pounds of torque. Uh, it's a beautiful vehicle. It offers about 21 miles per gallon on average. Plenty of seating and nice uh, safety. Is uh, It is five-star safety rated. Uh, some awesome features on here as well that I wanted to get into, but we appreciate uh, your interest and stay tuned. To start out, you got LED headlights and fog lights up front. As well, you've got a chrome grill with an interesting little uh, surround. As well, Kelly Edge all-season tires, brand new to the vehicle. So uh, we did add tires onto this, meaning that the tread life on the previous ones weren't nice enough uh, for meeting the standards here. So you can see what I mean about that grill there. Pretty interesting look with the Ford logo in the front. We have the vehicle priced at $27,182. No evidence of any curbing on the wheels, which is great. A little bit of wear and tear on the rotors, nothing major. Everything checks out great. Again, all season tires, brand new on there. And you also are gonna have directional awareness on the uh, mirrors. These are black uh, molded heated uh, mirrors. As well, it's got a splitting side as well, so you can get the blind zone checked out a little better. Beautiful entrance into the vehicle. You got leather touch points as well as French stitching around. Uh, so it's nice and comfortable to lay your arm down on here. It's not gonna be like a hard plastic surface, which is uncomfortable. Uh, power windows, power locks, power mirrors, standard on this. Uh, as well, you've got 10-way power seating with beautiful, beautiful thick uh, bolsters. Nice and comfortable seats. These don't wear down. They stay nice and uh, beefed out for a while, if you will. Moving into the vehicle. Plenty of room down here. Plenty of room up on the steering wheel. I feel nice and comfortable. This isn't a vehicle that uh, you'd be locking arms with someone on the other side. You got plenty of space on the cup holders or on the console, excuse me. Beautiful entertainment system there, or excuse me, infotainment system. You can also go through all of your driver uh, settings right here. You got a eight inch touchscreen display in the center here. Nice and easy to navigate. If you ever wanna to get to the home, press the home button. If you wanna to get to your audio, press the audio button. Um, climate options as well in here. Uh, but if you are to adjust your temp in here, it's gonna be up and down with these uh, levers here, or you can also just use the uh, touchscreen buttons here. You also have a heated steering wheel in this, which is an awesome feature. You have remote start in this vehicle as well. And you have uh, the capability of syncing your uh, vehicle to your phone uh, nice and easily with the USB cord here. Got a spot for your sunglasses, LED lights in the center, and you even have uh, a vanity mirror, which is great. Also, this is uh, so that you can speak into the vehicle. So if somebody calls you, uh, the microphone for you to talk into is right here. So you sound nice and clear over this. It's got a fantastic backup camera as well. You can pop the trunk with this button right here. As well, there's a tow haul mode, so this vehicle is all equipped uh, and ready to tow, which is nice. You got a spot for a hitch on there. Moving on to the back seats here, plenty of space. Uh, another thing I want to illustrate is the fact that this is uh, average retail is $31,125. We have this vehicle priced at $27,185, so about $3,000 or $4,000, excuse me, below average retail value. So that screams a good deal to me off the start. You're going to have some instant equity with this vehicle, meaning that you're buying it for a price that's lower than the average retail. So that's very nice. Cup holders for the backseat passengers, nice and important, as well as your climate controls. A lot of vehicles, you're not able to control that uh, climate from the back seat. As well, if you pull that lever there, as it just did, you're able to put down these seats to create a nice pass through to the trunk of the vehicles, uh, or to the trunk of the vehicle, yeah. This is the third row. Right now, the seats are down. Oops. 
This does have an automatic lift gate. I actually didn't press the button. I went to do it manually, but you can see here, uh, you can press that to lower the vehicle's uh, hatch. As well, you can see the seats, how they fold up like this. Oops. Interesting. So you're able to uh, flatten those seats out, stow them in the, in the bottom there if you need, just to get some storage up top. Uh, really nice setup as well. I should hit that uh, button. You can see the uh, vehicle is gorgeous even from behind here. This is the XLT model, four wheel drive, of course. You do have a terrain dial in the center to adjust all that and go from two wheel to four wheel on the fly. Again, these wheels are all looking great. No evidence of curbing or damage or anything like that. Body's all in nice shape here. Beautiful interior. Really not, not a whole lot of uh, wear and tear on the inside or out. Uh, vehicle's in great shape, which is nice. Uh, geez, even power seats on the on the passenger side. You don't see that all the time. But uh, if you have any questions about the vehicle or you'd like to learn more, you can hit the learn more button down below. We'd appreciate that. Get you some more information. Or if you'd like to come down and see us, you can reach us here at uh, 65 Windcrest Road in Rutland, Vermont. Just off of Route 7 South or you can call us at 802-776-5000. Ask for me, Bauer. Appreciate it. And I hope you're having a great day.